Hello, and welcome to Slightly Impressive Remodeling, or Renovations, or something like that. My name is Grifter, and we are playing The Sims 3. Oh good, did something break already? Oh. Oh. Okay, yeah, that's just a great place to pee, just right there in front of the front door. Thanks so much for that. Um, so if you're wondering why everybody's in the front yard, it's because I had to get them all out of the house to get them out of the way here. But look, look, we've got... We've got an extra room, like, almost everyone has their own room now. We converted this room here to Medivh's room. So Jaina and Agra get their room, which is still a little strange, but that's okay. And we've got the new master bedroom with all the all of Claire's stolen things. And don't worry, the hay bales are still here. Uh, but now we've got two bathrooms. Yeah. Like the upper middle class to which we aspire. And so now things should go a little bit better. Uh, just ignore the puddle in the extra living room space that we have now. It's fine. Don't don't even worry about it. It'll be okay. And Claire will probably add to the puddle any second now, and that is also fine. Okay, so what we need to do with Agra? It's like the middle of the night. No, it's only ten o'clock. Okay. So it turns out. You can't become a fairy by befriending a fairy, so uh, I actually want to make her a witch. And to make her a witch, we need to we need to make the potion or the elixir. So uh, any day now, we should be randomly getting some moonstones and some light beetles around here somewheres. Are these? I think these are still rhinoceros beetles. They're still, yeah, those look pretty rhinocerosy. So, uh, as soon as those go away, which, I don't know when that's gonna happen. Here, make yourself useful by not getting zombie attacked here. Just pick these up. Maybe we have to pick these up for the new ones to spawn, I don't know. I certainly am not cheating in any way, though. Don't even worry about that. Hopefully, eventually, we can make an elixir to cure Arlo. Because I, while I was looking all this stuff up, I read that Arlo, or that vampires... What? Caught his first insect. Yeah, boy, do I not care. Um, Grifter, Grifter, stop. Stop. Just stop. Go do something else with your time. You're supposed to be at work. Go to work, dude. Come on. What do we got? That, huh? Those aren't work things. Oh, maybe he has the night off. Do you have the night off? You do. You do not work weekends. Of course. Why would a spooky noise silencer work weekends? Everybody knows that spooky noises don't happen on weekends. That, that would be absurd. Okay. Oh, also, <laughs> Gustavo, he got some renovations as well. He got some nice... Uh, concrete walls and a metal floor. It's not in any way resembling a prison. Yeah, he's a robot, guys. It's the kind of stuff he likes. See? He approves of the decor. He even got a light bulb so that in the five seconds that he spends in there before he goes to sleep, he can see what he's doing. He's not going to bump into anything. Look at that. He's so well taken care of. Should we give him a window? I'll even give him a window just for you guys. See? Look at that. Look, it's just just amazing. <laughs> now we have thirty dollars. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to go without dinner for a day or two, but it's okay. There. I just I don't wanna anger I don't wanna anger the the free Simbot or free Gustavo 2014 movement or whatever it was. I'm gonna stay on their good side. So you know, Simbot rights and everything. There was something else I was gonna say and I forgot what it was. Uh, we're gonna make Agra a witch. We're gonna make an elixir to cure Arlo. Oh, right, because vampires apparently live five times as long as a normal sim, and we can't have that, because there's too much of people living way too long <clears throat> already. Alright, Grifter seems to be enjoying the new master bathroom quite well. He's practicing, you know, how he's gonna attack people while they're in the shower. He's gonna zombify them. This is how he entertains himself. It's actually the only thing he ever does when he's not working, which is fine. Whoa. 
Whoa, hey, get a room, you two. At least put some clothes on. What? What are you doing? What's happening over here? Hey! Hey! So did you get tickets to that movie? That one? With the happy things and the sad things? I heard Domingo talking about it earlier. Tickets? I'm a child! How do you think I'm gonna afford tickets? Happy and sad, kid. Happy and sad. Get tickets however you are able to. Find a way. Find a way. Uh, so I heard you are a criminal. Have you stolen anything lucrative, like a diamond or anything like that? Are you a good criminal? Oh, yes. Yes, I've made lots and lots of money. I've stolen all of the things. What about boxing? You get in any sort of fights? Lots and lots of boxing fights, yes. All the time. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, okay then. Oh, you're pretty impressive, Aunt Jaina. Yes. Yes, yes I am, pretty much. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. I'll just leave them to it, and, um, I'll go back to, go back to studying your cooking, okay? Do something with your life. I guess we should leave her a vampire for now, so she can get all these skills, right? Just before she becomes an adult. <laughs> Look at Jaina. Oh, yeah, not Jaina, you Sarah, always making the faces. Jared Frio. Heard you're quite the grill master, we'd like to sample some of your hot dogs. No, no, Jared, no. Look at the little TV viewing area we have now, though. I mean, it's a little weird that you have to walk through it to get to the bedrooms, but it's okay. Look, everyone's... We have enough chairs, almost enough chairs in the house for everyone to sit down at the same time. It's gonna be revolutionary. What happened to our mail lady? Did she get fired? How about you? Are you just as crazy? Ah, I have an idea. Let me sit here and ruminate about my idea for a minute. Okay, hey, hey, kid, get out of the way. I gotta get out of here. I got work to do. <laughs> Why is everybody screaming? Are you attacking people? For gaming! For gaming! Yeah, go play some nub for gaming. Hey, you know what? I think you're a vampire. What are you talking about? I smell like daisies. Or roses or something. If I were a vampire... Okay, okay, you're right. You're right, I am a vampire. Well, I am. I don't like you. I don't like non-humans. I cannot associate with you anymore, vampire. Jeez. Way to shame Arlo. What a jerk. Go repair the bathtub. Yeah, you already accused him. You don't need to do it again. Hey, I think you're a vampire still. <laughs> Arlo's just dumbstruck. He's just like, I don't know how to react to this. What am I gonna do? I don't want to live five times as long as a normal sim. This is a horrible life. I can't believe I've spawned two vampire children as well. Okay, you can put your eyebrow down now, dude. What are you doing? What is he doing? He's, he's confessing to being a vampire. Sure, sure you are. Sure you are, Arlo. Um... <laughs> Good, good luck with that. Okay, he fixed he fixed the bathtub. Fantastic. Now you need to upgrade it. Oh, we have more things to upgrade now. It's getting out of control. <laughs> he finally, finally gave up on that and decided to watch TV. You're supposed to be writing, dude. Okay, so now she's been promoted to campaign intern. All right, we got a bonus. We got all the money now, 751 bucks. And a new, newly renovated house. We are living the high life. <laughs> oh, what's this? Diligence has been noted. Yeah, okay. Okay, great. Uh-huh, yes. Alright, well, Griff. Griff, stop eating waffles for a second. You need to collect these things. Hopefully some of them are moonstones. I don't really know. How to tell. I don't know what those are either. I didn't put these spawners here. I mean, uh, these... These are were just as randomly placed by the game as, as all the other ones. But they're different. I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that. I don't know how gems work. We're gonna have to figure that one out. Gina, you need to, you need to do better in work, okay? You need body skill. What's wrong with you? Stressed out? Overworked. 
Maybe making you work hard wasn't the best thing to do. Oh, we did. We got a moonstone. All right. Now we just need a light beetle and some kind of wolf's bane or something. I don't know. Oh, a toad. We got plenty of toads. Right? <laughs> don't worry. Don't worry, Cupcake 2. Don't we have some other toads? I hope so. Oh my gosh. We don't have any other toads. Right, because we just had Cupcake and Cupcake 2. All right, uh, Claire. Make yourself useful and come over here and fish up some toads, okay? So, oh, don't don't choke. Hey, so I'm thinking about taking up painting. I've literally never seen anyone paint anything, but but I, I mean, how hard could it be? No one has anything to add to that. No one cares, Yasera. Nobody cares about him. Okay, you just need to go to work, Griff. Come on, you're slacking. What do we got here? Whoa. Okay, we got banished spirits. Poltergeist haunting. Oh, let's go see what that is. Could be interesting. Could be really stupid. There's really no way to know. Okay. Well, this this appears to be a poltergeist happening. We have to exercise an object. All right, go exercise that object. Go, go, come on. Come on, you can do it. Well, let's speed you up a little bit here. I'm not sure if it's your old age or just your zombieism. You don't get anywhere fast, though. Okay, so did did we did we win? Because that looked exactly like banishing a spirit. I'm just saying. Oh, hey there, girl. Who is this? Rochelle Bellamy. I've never seen you before. Oh yeah, I have. She's the person I said looked like Jennifer Lawrence, right? <laughs> um, where's the red? Okay, exercise, exercise, exercise. Okay, yeah, just just pee on the floor real quick and get back to work. Here, we'll, we'll do some speed. <laughs> He's in such a terrible mood. Oh, uh, looks like the man of the house came home. Are you... Are you the husband? Of Rochelle? Yeah, okay. Good. Finally finally got that taken care of. <laughs> hey, uh... There's a little bit of a mess in the, in the bedroom, but it's totally because of the poltergeist. Definitely not anything I did. Don't even worry about my clothes, the stain, it's okay, I just, it's a zombie thing. <laughs> He's like, hey, what happened in here? <laughs> Jeez, I mopped this up, stupid ghosts, leaving puddles of urine everywhere, that doesn't even make any sense. Griff, you are not going the correct way. <laughs> Why did you go, <laughs> you're, you're gonna go all the way around the house to get here? Who else lives here? Good grief. Who are you? Layla? Ta-da! You're welcome! Oh, they're so excited. They're... they're... S where are you guys going? Is everyone just afraid to use the front door? What are you guys doing? What is happening? You guys... You guys, what are you doing? <laughs> I can't even see what's going on. So are they just playing tag? They just wanted to run around the house. <laughs> okay, carry on. I guess Griff's going home before he falls over dead. Or uh, double dead. Uh-oh, looks like we got some lightning beetles already. All right. Go catch him. No sleep for you. Oh, all right. Claire caught a toad. That's good. We got, okay, we got light beetles, we got toads. Okay, we can make all the things. Okay. <laughs> he's gonna... He's gonna die. He's gonna fall over. How do I get the toad into his inventory? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Pause before you run off, Griff. Here, toad. Here, toad. Okay, we have a perfect quality toad. 
How do I get to... Am I gonna have to do some kind of crazy complicated maneuver where... Put a fish in a bowl. Don't even worry about what's happening right now, Cupcake 2. Nothing weird at all. Okay, so we're gonna... Stock. Okay. Put that toad in there. Uh, sure, we'll name it Marie. Um, I don't like that it suddenly got a name, but what are we gonna do? Scoop out Marie. Marie. Not Mori. Okay, uh, I'm just gonna take you to a happy place. Oh, hi, Cupcake, too. Uh, a lovely day we're having. Oh, yes, okay. Oh my gosh, what just happened? <laughs> zombie, zombie just fell off. <laughs> Go home, zombie. Go home before you hurt yourself. Sandy French wants to know if you'd like to go on a date. Look, I'm busy, woman. I'm trying to turn my daughter into a witch, okay? Oh, did I, did I already make the elixir? What happened here? Bottle of witches. Yeah, I did. Okay. Oh, I can turn three people into witches? That's nuts. Alright. Use, throw the elixir at Agra. There, she's already up. Good. She's just getting herself some blood. Hello there, daughter. Of course, everything he says just sounds like brains rawr, to everybody else. But what he's saying is, hey there, daughter. I have a gift for you. It's a belated birthday present. I saw you trying to... Use some magical spells and, uh, Agra, Agra, come on. Enough. What, what is everybody all happy about? <laughs> it's a lot of fanfare for, like, burned mac and cheese. Alright, here you go. Turned your skin kind of orange. It's, that's a, oh, and she got taller, uh, and then shorter. Um. So, is she no longer a vampire? So look, she's got a new, like, a mana bar. Play with magic. Prepare waffles. Okay, hold on, hold on. Is she not a vampire anymore? That would be awesome. If we could just turn everyone into witches instead of vampires. Styles McGraw. Why is your family not first in the list of people you know? Okay, it looks like she's no longer a vampire. This is great news. It'll be Medivh's birthday. Oh, okay. Well, we're gonna have to have... We'll have Medivh's birthday here in a minute. Okay, oh no, actually, yeah, let's do... Let's do Medivh's birthday, because I want to see how... How ugly he turns out. Are these hot dogs? <laughs> Did Claire make some hot dogs? Just... Just for funsies, and then not give them to uh, Jared. Alright, let's get Medivh to blow out some candles. Purple derp. Alright everybody, everyone drop what you're doing and saunter on over here. Got another birthday party. Hey, speed cheering! Woo! Jeez, there's so many people in this family now. All right, here we go. Oh, Griff didn't even get into position. Woohoo! I really hope you put some clothes on. Okay, here we go. And boom! <laughs> I like the haircut. Okay. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Because of his success in school, you may choose a trait. Yeah, but we're not going to. Alright. <laughs> Genius kleptomaniac couch potato born salesman. Wow, so he's just kind of just a terrible person. <laughs> he's, 
has great aptitude and does not use it on anything except breaking the law. All right, let's get a look at you. Whoa, we got taller. What's with everybody getting taller and shorter and taller and shorter? Well, I mean, he's certainly... I don't know. He's not the handsomest fellow in the world, but I don't think he can really hold the candle to Agra still. If anything, Agra got even uglier when she became... <laughs> uh, whatever she is, a witch, a human, an orc, instead of a vampire. Yep. All right, well, that's that. Okay, so we'll mess with the magic stuff later. For now, let's go feed Cupcake 2. You guys can stop cheering any second now. That would be fantastic. Okay, okay, don't go to school yet. You need to go feed Cupcake 2. Cupcake 2, how's it going? Everything's everything's totally fine. Nothing weird happened this episode, right? Right? Everything's fine. You just murdered a toad! You put him in- I saw you do it! You put him in that thing and you cooked him! And you made someone into a witch! But how could you do this? What is this horrible- I don't even- Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well. Okay, thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. Okay, bye.